Hey guys, welcome back to another uh, well, video. This time we are playing the Architect Paris thanks to Enodo Games. Uh, thank you for the privilege of uh, having these in advance before it was released. Even though you guys, you'll have this. Uh, th the game was already released now that you are watching this video. But uh, hey, I was waiting for this game for quite some time now and I have the, the possibility to, to check it out to see what we can do in the game. So, uh, if we go to a new game here, we can choose, first of all, our logo, uh, company's logo. Uh, I will go for this and then here we can go for Skibith, uh, that's the company name, right? <laughs> this game is actually more like a sandbox. You can build stuff, but their functionality is... It, it, it's just there. It's I mean, you can you don't do money for the city. You cannot interact with the traffic or or so. So it's only about you uh, creating a city as you please, the way you want that to look. Uh, most likely, what you see here, you actually won't see in your game because uh, there will be some changes done from what I understood. But this is the information button, and when you hover ever over this gray areas you can see all these extra informations which usually it's very helpful to to read i read uh, read them already and this is the map um of paris and as you can see we have four districts uh district number one 16 21st and uh, 24th uh these ones are the first one you can play with and then the other will be released on time um there are big landmarks, of course, this is uh, where the Louvre uh, is, uh, here is uh, the Notre Dame Cathedral and so on. Here all, also you can, you can see all the buildings, all the architectural buildings you, you, that are available at this point in the game. You can just play through them and see what you like, you can even create your fi favorite one if you want to. Um, for instance, if you click on this little heart and then go here, you'll see uh, the ones that you like most. Um, that's something that we can actually do the here. And uh, well, uh, let me check. I I'm going to start with this district, with district number 24. And then press on the little key here to load the game. Um, so yeah, this game is since 20... Uh, they are working, and other games is working since 2018 on this game, and it's finished now. Uh, it's been some time since there was uh, no news about it, so I'm so glad uh, finally they actually worked like in silence and then, like in secrecy, and we didn't know about it. But hey, it is up there, it's out, we can actually play. Uh, take into consideration the fact that it's still in alpha mode, so. Uh, things might be wonky or not properly working in some cases, maybe. Uh, but still, things will keep be uh, being added to the game uh, during time. Uh, so, what can I see here? It's of course the movement WASD. Uh, if I keep the mouse uh, wheel button hold, uh, we can just move around the city. Zooming out with the mouse button as well. And if we, we use the right uh, mouse button, uh, we can uh, rotate, but depending on the uh, zooming, uh, we can rotate more or less. Uh, but by the way, this is the maximum amount of zooming in, at least for now. Uh, but as soon as we go into the uh, drawing uh, board, uh, we will uh, be able to zoom in a bit more. Uh, on top here, I see that we can change the lighting. We can make it uh, at, at uh, the uh, sunrise, uh, noon, afternoon, and uh, sunset. Uh, sun, of course, we can uh, also change the weather. Uh, we can make it rain if we want to, you know, to, to have a, a different as look. I see a helicopter there, but let's keep it uh, daylight. So, I chose the district number 24. Let's see what, what else we can do. From what I do know is that we cannot, if we find this church, which is the, lang which is the landmark for our district, we cannot do that much of a change to it. Well, actually, no change. But we can change all these districts here in the neighborhood by pressing on this button, which is the drawing board. Here we can 
change back uh, to the map itself and here go back to the city <coughs> menu uh, here we have some extra information about the uh, landmarks uh, we can see what are the main projects um, for each of these and um, yeah let, let's let's uh, green pagoda great pagoda urban rice field demolish what's already on the plot and then go with something else oh my god <laughs> no let's go with the rice urban so that's one of the uh, the way of doing this and playing the game. You can change completely the architecture. There are lots of uh, architectural styles. For instance, if we click on this building and go on the uh, drawing board, read everything is here, it will be helpful, of course. So here, as I said, we can zoom in and out more. Uh, we can play a tiny bit with the lightning as well. Uh, make, it, make sure you, you find the perfect one for you. And as soon as you click on it, uh, I see we have here the possibility to, uh, to demolish it with uh, this uh, uh, button. Undo it in case we made a boo-boo and we didn't want to do that, which is a good thing, trust me. And uh, here we can also, um, we can completely uh, change the look. Uh, we can make it... Uh, as we please. We have quite a lot of uh, possibilities, uh, architectural possibilities. Uh, very modern one, uh, very um, old style. Um, <coughs> the Hosmans are quite old style, architectural style. Uh, yeah, the possibilities are quite endless. Um, for instance, if we can even uh, change the... Uh, whoa. The, the the level of the building but of course we can't go that high it, it will look very bad um the roof style can be changed as well from what i can see which is really nice because uh, you can uh, add the, uh, you can make it uh, the way you want to we can change the texture on the roof yeah of course not grass um, and we can also uh, change the facades uh, by clicking on this button and we have only actually only one uh, choice here usually there are more uh, but only one choice and of course uh, there are lots of other possibilities we can uh, add an extra like a not balcony but it is no it's pointed out uh, the wall uh, here it's on the um, horizontal and here vertical it depends well yeah just play with it this way you can make your own style and uh, from what i do know um what else can we do welcome to the plot editor here we can even change the the plot editor so uh, we can actually create uh, come closer to or inside oh not that close confirm so we can add like an extra uh, line here, which means that if we go back to uh, here to the drawing, now we have two possibilities, two buildings to add here, right? So let's go down here, sorry, like that. And then the other one, let's add it the same way. See, now, now we change completely the, 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 the look of the building. So the possibilities are, I want to say endless, but well, maybe not that endless. Anyways, there are lots, there are super uh, many possibilities to change the look. Uh, you can even do different combination uh, between buildings, like an old one and a more modern one, like green one, uh, which as you can see now, this one, we can change it as we please. I like this one. And as soon as we, you know, uh choose the, the the perfect one we just click on uh, on this or undo uh yes i want to keep it and well now we have uh, the building uh, created by us here uh what else can we do uh let me have another look for instance we have this uh, uh this particular area here 
Hey, now I can zoom a, li a bit more inside. So from above, I believe... Oh, we have even people. Huh. Now we can zoom more. I don't know why. Uh, well, it is what it is. So I'm glad we can zoom more. Before I... Uh, when, when I zoomed, uh, I was uh, limited. Cool. Still uh, discovering stuff, even though I played the game a bit uh, in up in front. Well, th the zooming, uh, it's a bit annoying. Uh, y you either zoom too much or not enough. Um, so, what else we can do? We can actually completely delete this... Um area. And then... Uh uh, ah, yeah, sorry. I was looking for this one. Sorry. Drawing. And now it's completely waste, uh, wasteland. So I can... I, I was looking to to the drawing board. Uh, still, uh, um, I'm nobody's. <laughs> um, but I, I want to make one big area here. So now that if I click on this... I will have a whole building or whatever I want. But there are like few parts there too, possibilities to add uh, multiple type of parks. And if you keep clicking on them, they will randomize, they will com continuously changing. So just click on uh, through them until you, you, I don't know, you have a perfect, uh, uh, the perfect look for them, as you please, right? Um, here we have some uh, different type of plazas. Or a parking area. No? Yes. Like that. We can have a parking area. And let's say we are satisfied with this. Now we have the parking area here. In between the, the roads. Uh, imagine these people living here. <laughs> looking at the parking area and hearing all the noises from the parking area. Uh, the parking area, parking building. So, um, you can, I, I, from what I do know, it's that we can, you know what? Uh, let's, let's go on this one, this big one, uh, building. And then let's go here, a drawing, and uh, let's make a big, this plot is not available. What do you mean is not available? Now it is, right? Okay, good. So, Let's, can we build, oh my god, we can even build one huge building there. Let's make a green one. Something like that. No, okay, let's, let's keep the grass on top. Let's make it a, a bit taller. Let's play a bit with the facades. Like so. Well. If you think about it, actually, it's quite. Uh, we have quite a lot of uh, possibilities to, to to change this, and the fact that the game, as I said, is in early access, uh, lots of things will keep uh, be added to the game. But you know what? You can even undo uh, the the look of uh, of this uh, district. So you can turn back to the original one if you want to. Um, and I was even thinking actually to... Let's demolish everything. Uh, like so. Like this, okay. Oh. And then go here. Um, click on this and make a huge park. Yeah, I prefer a, a huge park. <clears throat> With lots of trees, colorful trees. Uh, if I could... I would have kept uh, clicking on the uh, park, you know, w the lake would have changed, maybe w I would have multiple lakes, different pathways and so on. Really nice. Uh, so in time, we can do this, I mean, you can transform this uh, completely for the entire map. Imagine the way, um, uh, I don't know how the FPS will, will run eventually when you have the full map. But uh, I, I believe uh, the creators will think of a way uh, to not affect our computers that much. And you can actually try to Google, look at Google Earth and 
try to build all these buildings uh, mostly as they are in real life or j just completely change them make them like it's uh, netherlands or um all, make them all green and so but uh, as i said the only thing that we can't change are the landmarks that's that's uh, everything uh, else uh if we change for instance uh i started with this one with district number 24 if we change to district number 21 and click on the key uh then we will change district number 21st 21 21st so um before we did changes here and now we, we do here uh, as you can see, we we have both of them uh, open, and not only uh, only this one. But maybe in the future, when we do these kind of changes, maybe we can have the possibility to see only this district and not this one, um, or we can see all of them. All we can do in this game so far is play with the architectural style, keep changing the buildings, make it look like in real life, or make it look uh, differently. Uh, we cannot change the roads, as I said, the traffic cannot be influenced that much. Uh, uh, it is only the artificial intelligence running the cars on the streets. Um, it's nice that we have some small boats here. Oh my god. Uh, small boats, we can see them, we can see cars. Uh, but uh, that's uh, all we can do and see uh, around here. Well, this is it guys. This was the first uh, look at the game. Um, tell me what you think about the game. Uh, if you are interested, uh, you should add it on your uh, wish list uh, or maybe even think of buying it. Uh, I really do enjoy it. I do like it, uh, especially that I build uh, Little France on in City Skylines and I am a big fan of France. As you can imagine, also building uh, lots of stuff uh, from Nantes, from also from France, during my live streams. But hey guys, thank you very much for watching this. Uh, as I said, hope you did enjoy it. If uh, you do, don't forget to hit the like button. Leave some comments. I want to see your opinion on this. And uh, subscribe if you are new to my channel. Uh, see you in the next video. And until then, take care guys. I salute you.